My name is Anderson McGee. There's never been a day of my life when I didn't know God loved me. I was raised in the church. My grandfather was a Nazarene pastor and my mom was a preacher's kid. The soundtrack of the mornings of the first 18 years of my life were provided by the Christian music drifting out of the speakers of my mom's radio. On Sundays, you'd always find us on the third row piano side of our little country church. It was from that location that my journey of faith began. My faith was formed as I sat and listened to the passionate, tear-filled testimonies of the living saints among us as they shared what the Lord had done for them. Through their stories, I learned of a God that could do infinitely more than we could ever ask or imagine. The church was a place where I found love, meaning, and belonging. By the age of 11, I had given my life to Christ and was diligent in attending church and fascinated to learn more about what this new life in Christ meant for me. I was growing, learning, and thriving at church among God's precious people. The church had become my refuge from a world that was both challenging and increasingly cruel as the years moved along. I was a child living with both attention deficit and obsessive compulsive disorders. I had a large and noticeable gap in the front of my teeth, and I was a significantly more expressive child than the other boys my age. I found myself to be largely not as interested in the same activities they were. In other words, I was different. I knew it as much as I knew God loved me. My name is Anderson McGee, and this is my story.